Hey guys, Captain Kurt Fister here. Thanks for joining me. I just got an email from a gentleman up in Canada and he asked me, hey, I don't, I don't know how to roll up the wing. Can you show me how to roll up the wing? I'll tell you what, there's a lot of ways to pack away your glider and, and stow it in the bag. And this is the one that I prefer. I think this is a lot easier because one of the problems that we face uh, when we're uh, getting our wing back out of the bag for the next flight is tangles. A lot of people get these, all these lines. You see all these lines here? Uh, sometimes it can get pretty confusing, especially if you get a tangle. Sometimes it can take you quite a bit of time to get it out. Um, there's a very easy method. If you do it the way I'm going to show you right here, you'll never get a tangle. The simple thing is you lay out your wing, you pull the line straight. And at this point, we've already flown it, so these lines are already, we already know they're straight and they're not tangled. And so what we do is we grab the lines by the connection points, the risers. We hold them right here by the connection points. I usually just put them in one hand. I come down with the other hand and I grab all of the lines and I just start pulling them through my hand. When I get about this much, I just lay this on the ground like that and I pull all these lines through my hand. And basically what I'm doing is just grouping them together into a nice straight line. You'll notice my glider is starting to kind of clamshell in on the tips. And that way, when I go to open it the next time, it'll be all uniform. It'll be ready to open. It'll be centered. All I have to do is plop it onto the field into the wind, and she'll open right up. So we get it all mushroomed up like this, and we walk it out. You'll notice a nice group of, group of lines all the way over to the risers. We walk back over to the risers, and we always pick it up by the connection points, like this. And then what I do is I come in about two feet, and I just let those hang down. I take these risers right now, I'm going to just put it over my right wrist like this. I'm going to grab the lines that are going up to the wing, which are right here. And all I'm going to do is turn my hand around and put a twist in it like that. That's all I want to see. When I get that, I'm going to grab these main lines again. I'm going to put it in my right hand like this. And I'm going to pull this loop off of my wrist. I'm going to set this on the ground at the same time. I'm going to set the risers down. That way they're not hanging there. Okay, so we pull the loop through. Now all you do is everywhere that your hand is at, you reach through that hole and you grab the main lines. You pull this loop off of your hand and now you've got another loop. So wherever your hand is at, you reach through, grab the main lines, pull it through, make another loop. Reach through where your hand is at, grab the main lines, pull it through. And you can do this and pretty soon you'll get very quick at it You'll be able to pack up your wing in no time, and there is absolutely no way that your lines can be tangled the next time you come to the field. When you come to the field, you'll simply reverse it. Now I'm going to show you how to stick it in the bag. You don't want to stick it if you, uh, if you have our product. We sell Fresh Breeze. And by the way, we have free training in all 50 states. Uh, other people charge $1,500 to $3,000 for training. If you get equipment from us, we just think it should be free. There's no time limit. There's no price tag on safety. So you can train with us as much as you want. You can even bring friends in with you to train on your equipment that you purchase from us, and we'll train them as well. Nobody pays for training at Flight Junkies. So this is some of the stuff that we, that we teach you during our training. And uh, right now I'm going to stick it in the bag, and we'll be all set and ready to go and ready for our, the next day that we fly. Over to our stuff sack. This is a real nice stuff sack. Fresh Breeze offers this, and um, I really enjoy this one. You notice a little pocket right here. That's the place to put your risers. And the reason we want to put our risers in there is we want to keep them away from all the other lines. If you don't get the risers near the other lines, you can't get a tangle. And with my method of braiding it, there's no way that this can be tangled. So when you come to the field next time, you're going to be in the air flying for a, about a half an hour before the other guys even get the tangles out of their lines. Drop this in the middle here, plop it down, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab these risers, and I just leave my braids right in the middle. I'm going to grab these risers like this. I'm going to open up that little tiny bag right here, and I'm going to stuff those risers down in that bag. And now they can't get near anything else. Okay, now this is a really cool method. We don't want to we don't want to just pull the, pull the bag in here and trap air in here. These open cells need to allow the air to spill out of this. So what did I do is I grab lower like this, and I pull, and I go right to the middle. And I do the same on the other side, and then I come back to this side. And I just grab something a little bit lower than the cells because I don't want to trap the air in there. And then I just keep drawing it in little by little, 
and in a couple pulls, the wing is ready to wrap. It's already ready to go. Everything is uniform. The lines cannot get tangled. I pull my bag around it, and we have a little drawstring right here. We're just gonna draw it up like this. We're gonna stuff it in there. Tighten up your little, your little plastic drawstring. And then we got a little clip here. You can take this clip and just open it up and connect it to right there. And you're ready to go. If you do it this way, you'll never get tangles. You'll love doing this. You'll spend most of your time flying instead of on the ground like the other guys trying to get their tangles out because their instructor didn't show them how to do that. Come see us at flightjunkies.com or poweredparagliding freetraining.com. We do free training in all 50 states. Thank you for joining me.